switching from one town to another town and I wanted to take my medical records with me. I hadn't looked at them before. So I got the medical records and was looking at them and discovered that they said, I'm a street drug user. I know my, my colleague had exactly the same look on his face. He was just totally flipped out laughing because I am the farthest thing from a street drug user. So then the question was, how the heck did this get in my medical record? He was doing the new patient interview stuff and he was asking me questions about things and um, one of the things that came up was I was a domestic violence survivor. How my ex-husband had been <clears throat> a drug dealer and had um, you know, his clients didn't feel safe around Miss Goody Two-Shoes. Then one day they decided to make sure that they had a way to some sort of hold on me and they, they spiked some of my stuff and uh, it was really incredibly terribly frightening for me. Just one of the most terrifying things that's ever happened to me in my life. Instead of making a note about the domestic violence, which did not show up in my medical record, the doctor made this note that I was a street drug user. And from that point on, the people in the healthcare system, you know, it's like they didn't trust a word I said. I'd gone through all these years fighting an uphill battle, trying to communicate about healthcare issues because they had this idea that I was a street drug user.